What's massively improved your mental health? Sleep. Well, I gotta take notes from this guy. So, um... Welcome to Depression Memes. This is fascinating, so <laughs> When people commit suicide are selfish because they hurt others, loved ones, blah blah blah. Me, so emotionally blackmailing them, ignoring the fact their suffering is not. Do you have any idea how fucking deluded you sound? So, uh, welcome. I've already said that shit, and my favorite conspiracy theory is that everything will be alright. Mine is that freedom of speech. It actually exists. Because it doesn't. Okay, anyway, life update. No, bro, I just want to uninstall it. Where was I even going with that conspiracy thing? Oh my fucking god. Me going through life, absolutely no goals or plans in mind, because, because I never even thought I'd live past a certain age. Dude, that's going to be me, like, next year. And if that doesn't happen, the next, like, five years. And I'm fast, it isn't a lot for a house. Half a bed, a pot to piss in, and a microwave. The house. So I only made one video today, and that was, like, two hours ago. So I'm not, like, in my flow state. So... Hooray. Can we meet? Absolutely not. I'm just an internet person. I do not exist. Am I that same because I'm horny? Or depressed and I need a dopamine? Fuck, I actually started thinking on that one. Okay. So, I could never have used substances. I love substances. Oh, God. Is it the one? <laughs> But you forgot me. <laughs> I'm just like Tony, the way I spend most of my time eating or having emotional outbursts. I spend my time spinning, listening to music, occasionally doing push-ups, occasionally making the music we're listening to, or occasionally what making the videos you're watching. So someone on the internet trying to help me. Failed college, being an awful person, dead girlfriend. Bless me, holy trend. Well, the noose kind of looks like that fucking, uh, Egyptian thing. Um, it's like their equivalent to the cross or some shit, I don't know. So, yeah, interesting comparison. When someone asks me how, how I'm doing, but I also don't want them to feel sorry for me. I'll probably be sad for the rest of my life, but besides that, I'm good. <laughs> I just say, okay, and that's really what I mean. About half the time. This is like the end of the tunnel. The tunnel. <laughs> My demons planning on how they're going to beat the hell out of me for, for, for an extra two hours. Being anxious as hell trying to get some rest. My last brain cell at 2am. Looking for my will to live. Ooh. My will to live, me. It ain't even paying attention, damn. Crippling hopelessness. Me just wanting to sleep. Was it a mistake to come here? Especially when I'm not liking my flow state. But anyway, here lies the smart, happy kid I used to be before depression and anxiety appeared. I see pictures of myself back when I was like in grade two or three, and I wonder what happened to that kid. I said, when I'm 30, I'll kill myself. Sorry, Grandma, let's get you to bed. Procrastinating death. Really? I think Desmond, I bet after the teacup ride, you don't want to shoot yourself with that nasty revolver anymore. Uh, do you feel any better? Mm. Yeah, I guess. Oh, that's great. Charlie, we did it. Successful mission. For a bit, then it ended. Like good things always do. Huh? Well, yeah, but nice things can't last forever. That's exactly it. Are the best parts of life really just finding momentary distractions to keep yourself busy so you don't think about the harsh realities of life for a second? I can ride roller coasters, meet new friends, and spend time with my family all day long. It doesn't change the fact that the sun is just gonna explode, and all 
this was for nothing. Uh, Pip, did you want to show Desmond anything else, or are we, uh, we good? Well, did you want to show me anything? Uh, all right, yeah, uh, what about that? What? Yeah. Damn. <laughs> like, he's not wrong. But anyway, I couldn't wait till I got home to pass the time in my room alone. What is music taste if not high school trauma persevering? Someone told me once that what you listen to at 14 is what you listen to for the rest of your life. And not a day goes by where I don't prove them right. <laughs> hmm. Ew, I stepped in shit. Dude, listen, I'm either the worst, or I'm better than all of you, and I'll seriously fucking murder you if you look at me funny. Or ever fuck with me ever again. That's, I'm, I'm, I'm with both of those. At the same time. All the time. If you touch me, I'll fucking beat the shit out of you, even if it's a minor tap on the shoulder. And me, tr and then there's me trying. My depression telling me I'm not good enough. My schizophrenia telling me I'm the chosen one. <laughs> hmm. My life more depression. Stay safe, y'all. Okay. Not caring about obsessively caring about me. Dude, it's my last year of high school right now. How do you think I fucking feel? <laughs> me connecting all my childhood traumas to my issues today. Okay. 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 You want to hear a short story? I was on call. With one of my friends, and we were playing Delta and, and my mum calls me out because, oh, she's looking at pictures or some shit. Or I got curious because they were looking at pictures, right? And apparently, I was dropped in a tub when I was a week old. And because Tism, I don't like putting my eyes under the water at where I can't breathe and stuff, right? And I'm just like, well, thanks, mum. What the fuck? And I've gotten hit in the head so many times and I flinch really easily. And it's just generally in a very unpleasant existence. So this one isn't actually incorrect. And I'm going to send it to my mama, like, straight after I finish this video. But anyway, oh, I don't do drugs. Just suffering for me, thanks. Also, I technically, apparently, have diagnosed asthma, but I haven't needed a puff of since, uh, exactly five years ago. So... I probably couldn't try weed. Also, people don't fake depression. They fake being okay. Remember that. Be kind. Don't life's just depressing Pokemon at 5.30pm outdoor games. 10, uh, 10 normally stress free life, friend. Life now. Yeah, Pokemon fell off fucking hard. Or maybe I just grew up. I, I, pl I played Gunvolt and Sonic fan games. And, and just Pokemon was just too slow in comparison. <sighs> He's sending my friends encouraging message, even though their life is a mess too. There was one very, um, tricky period of my life where I got hopeful messages from one of my friends. Always gonna fucking appreciate that. I don't want to talk about it, but, that, but, but that's the only example I got. But anyway, I know what you're going through right now. And I know it's a lot. Just know... Fuck you, Woody. I hope you die in Chapter 4 of Delta and get physically torn to shreds. Just, your guts goes fucking everywhere. But anyway, look at what you've done to your child. <laughs> My mum's dying on the couch of a fucking, um, cold. So, and I'm, and I'm just gonna nuke her with those. But anyway, family. You know what? Fuck all of you. <laughs> Me, when someone makes a joke about my appearance... Yes! Yes, the forehead! Fuck! There's this one kid who's barely got like a two head who I just call five head lots because, because it's funny. It's like an inside joke. It's not bullying or anything. But when in reality, I have a five head, not nearly a six head. But granted, that's part of the joke. But anyway, bad decisions, me. What's wrong with you? Trust issues? Okay, insecurity and stubbornness. Those are big ones for me. Like, I'll actively flex them. Hell I think yeah. I've already done that. Hey, come on, baby! Come on! Yes! Come on! Ah! Yes! 
really depends. I'm sure that means nothing. No, no, you are destroying my family. You're crazy. I feel sorry for your child. Disrespectful. I will pray for you. You're killing your mother. Yep, yep, yep. Flying monkey, bingo. Oh my god, flying monkey. I don't even want to edit this one, man. I'm being real. Asking family for help. Diet, die. What the fuck is wrong with these people? Well, fuck, now I have to edit the video. Anyway, if someone can't live their own life the way they please, they might as well die. The fucking eye funny watermark. Are you serious? What's up? You're joking. Me after realizing I'm not mysterious and nonchalant to have no socials. I didn't anticipate this actually like fucking with me or anything. I'm just, I was sitting on the couch uploading my um Sonic Roblox games video. And I was like, okay, okay. So I'm gonna record a Reddit video, but I don't know what it, what it's gonna be on. Then I'm gonna shower. Then I'm gonna work out, and then I'm gonna make more music, and it's gonna be super duper cool. Blah blah blah. I don't do that on purpose. But like, now I'm gonna be here for another like three minutes. Gonna have to edit some shit. And um, yeah, there is no plan B. There's also no plan A. I have no idea what I'm doing. No matter how much I change, I'll always be me. I, I will always suffer. Insults, already hating myself, me, other people. Yeah, that, dude, I just ignore people. Like, straight up. I'm not... Like, like, people, like people are literally screaming at me, and I'm just, like, doing my fucking maths. Full hearty idiot, the press. <laughs> oh... Me trying to ignore the emptiness. I feel like I'm meant to feel something in my chest, like confidence or adrenaline, way more than I actually do. And I just don't, and I'm really skinny, which doesn't help. And it's just like, uh, the empty spot in your bed is for snacks, not for liars. Jackson, you have never been in a relationship. Now, at least. Wow, I have a lot of people at this point. Oh, reliable. Have a coping mechanism. I would dye my hair a bright color. I dye my hair blue because I saw Dan TDM do it once when I was like six and thought it was neat. Fuck you. But anyway, I try not to think about it too much. Rich was adapted to crushing pressure in oppressive darkness. Me too, sweetie. Me too. How I sleep at night knowing I've, ever, I've, I've irreparably damaged and will most likely die alone due to my inability to accept love or act right. I feel so depressed, I can't even blink. Brain, anxiety, logic. Hmm. Get rid of all toxic people in your life. That's a weird way to tell me to kill myself. <laughs> I'ma just uh, post these in the group chat sometime soon. But anyway, my routine is very simple. I wake up and suffer. When you, when you didn't get enough sleep and every little thing is annoying you. <laughs> and your mental illness is acting up, but you don't want the squad to quit on you. Insecurity. Some people these days. Cry cry have a really are special needs. And why is my music fucking loading? Drunk, drunk. When you find someone who is just as dead inside as you are. A first sign of the beginning of understanding is the wish to die. 100% depressed. Me seeing a complete stranger and imagining a whole life of the mother pathetic and lonely. Yeah, yeah. And my music's working. Okay. I am the type of person that will sit in the bathroom and cry, but then walk out like nothing ever happened. Yeah. Why, God? Why, God? Okay, let's see what this is about. 
Vou aparecer a minha sala na sala. Clever fuck, aren't you? If you feel like doing that, um, try talk to someone. If that doesn't work, talk to yourself. There's a phone number you can ring. There's all this shit you can try. Because frankly, you probably shouldn't. Yeah, you you don't know what happens afterwards. There's like a good chance it's just nothing or you're on fire for the whole bit of it. But anyway, man, it's so simple. Just put his head in your lap and whisper, you did good. And he says, you're yours. They know, but don't use it. Fucking assholes. That makes it worse. Oh, one of the gateway drugs to my degeneracy. Well, you could argue that was the Sonic or Pokemon fandoms, but I blame Lost Paws and Nux because, frankly, that's just funnier to explain to people. And that led me to VTubers. That led me to ASMR. And we know how that goes. Go ahead. Go oh, no. I can't. If only this loaded and didn't break my state. Whenever there's a minor inconvenience in my life, suicide, give up. Maybe real friends are the ones you... Ah, shit, that know me again. We send a risky suicide joke. There's a little group... There's a little too tight for the group chat. And no one replies for hours. May suicide. Is this a, no? It's not. Oh, it's nothing. Just feeling a little tired today. Feeling tired. Depression, anxiety, self-loathing. When you're when you're telling yourself I don't care, and then your vision starts to get blurry. Person. Hey there. You okay? Yeah, I'm completely fine. My face during the interaction. So um. I don't want to go 20 minutes like I did with Class of 09 because I don't know how long it's going to go or, well, how well it's going to do. And frankly, I'm down to coming back here in like two or three weeks my time. See what's up. So make sure to like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you <coughs> eventually. I don't know when that is, but uh, I do shit like this, and I play games, and I make music, and I dump it on my second channel occasionally. It's mostly just background music for the stuff I get.